This is Matrix Lord 212 for Matrix Vlog. Hello, everybody. Today is April Fools. The one day I hate because I can't do any podcasts or anything because everything is bull and lies and pranks. It's the one day I can't upload. I'm just going to do videos. I'm not going to do anything. Um, you know, I worked the uh, past couple of days, so kind of tired. Um, I have to do an overnight tonight, which means that I have to readjust my sleeping schedule. And I have to sleep in the day uh, today. Um, so that way I'm refreshed for tonight when I go into work. Um, so not really looking forward to that. But <laughs> other than that, I'm going to try to get some comic book reviews up today. Um, it's really sad, I gotta tell you, the fact that no more new comics. My comic book collecting days are done right now. Hopefully not forever, but it looks like it may be done for a long time. Um, so I do have a lot to review, though. Um, but I started to get, like, depressed because I'm like, well, what's the point? I mean, if I get caught up, it's not like I could read the next issue because it's not happening. So I got to get out of that funk and I got to review, you know, some of the stuff I have. So I have nothing left. And then after that, I got to see what I'm going to do because uh, I might want to watch some shows, get caught up with that. You know, it's just this whole situation is just taxing, you know, it's taking its toll and people getting depressed and you know you just gotta keep going and hopefully this crap will end this this isolation this quarantine this nonsense i mean like i said you know usually i'm home all the time until i go to work and then i make the trek out unless we have to do food shopping or laundry but you know right now i think we're okay with that so yeah, this this just the fact that you have to just stay home. You know, you get bored real fast. And then the thing that sucks is that people are not helping the situation. Like last night the PlayStation thing was down. I'm like, really? You know, like they even posted about it. It's like, how could these things fail with everything going on? People are gonna be going on PlayStation, they're gonna be playing PlayStation. So how could that not work? Or how could that not be at its 100% efficiency? Same thing like YouTube, right? With everything going on, everybody's making videos. So why would YouTube decide to be a bunch of lazy whatever and, and give you lower resolution and limit your videos? I mean, that's kind of bullshit. That really pisses me off. You know, so you got those two bullshit thing going on. Because now, not only... You know, can't you do the PlayStation sometimes? But now you can't even watch a movie on there because the thing is not... The, the thing you can't... It will skip and everything. Also, the YouTube videos, they want you to limit uploading. And, and then the resolution is not clear with that. So that sucks. Can't even, like, order stuff. Certain things. Because it takes forever to ship now. Because Amazon's, like, workers are, like rioting and whatever and they don't even want to like package your stuff so you know to, when you go to order something from amazon like i just did um it's taking like weeks to get which is crazy so that's done then then you can't even you know if you want to get a book you can't get a book because the bookstores are closed if you go to order it's taking forever for whatever's in your house you gotta make do with whatever's in your house you know Unless you have to go food shopping, wherever. But, like, again, these things are not helping, you know? So, we did the live stream a couple days ago, and, and the live stream wasn't even working right. Nobody saw it. And well, what's the point then? So, I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of pissed that all these companies should be doing things to make the transition easier while you're home, you know? I don't think YouTube's helping. I don't think they're helping the streaming or the Zooms or the or stream yards. I think they're, making, they're hindering it. So that's pissing me off. All right, so if you can't 
let's see. Now, now we're getting to the point where, okay, if let's just say you don't rely on Wi-Fi and you have like hotspot or whatever the hell you use, whatever. Now you can't use it because it doesn't work fully. So that's out. Watching movies, that might be out because it might not work. What the hell you do? Sleep all day? What do you do? Exercise in your house? I mean, this is like just... I just wish these companies weren't so damn stupid. They would make... They would they would raise the bar or step up, you know. Even with the phone stuff, too. It's like, you know, a lot of people are not available. Workforce is cut in half. I mean, now they want to limit the buses, limit the trains. Well, how am I supposed to go to work? Like, you're going to make it every hour, so I have to go to work an hour early? Like, that's just and sit there? This is, like, dumb. Whoever's, like... Cutting back on the buses and the and the trains that get you to work, that's stupid. So now they're gonna make it where you can't work. If you can't work, you can't make money. You can't make money, what are you gonna do? It's ridiculous. Getting sick of this. Now I gotta go to work hours early. I can't even punch it. It's like so that's annoying. Um so yeah, and all my favorite places when you go when when I'm on my way to work or when I'm on break, can't eat there. So you got to eat while you, you got to walk and eat or you got to bring it back to your job. That's annoying too. Hate that. I'm used to like, you know, when I'm hungry, I want to go sit and eat. Now I can't do that. Oh, man. Nothing. All the movies are delayed. No more comics. It's like, oh my God, you can't even go to church. You can't do anything. I'm getting frustrated, guys. I'm going to try to find things to do. Take care. Bye for now.